I feel like we make it too easy for the younger generation. The younger generation have to be hungry too to say, I want to play Champions League, I want to play in Italy, in Germany, in England, in Scotland, in, 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 in battle day for day for your position that you play on the weekend. When Bob Bradley was the coach, how many players played in, in, in MLS? Most of the players came from Europe. I called Jordan Morris and I talked with him. And, and I asked him, I said, I know that Werder Bremen really wants you and you can play there and you have the opportunity. You never know what comes after you play already Bundesliga and you can go farther. And he said, you know what? I want to go home. My dad is the doctor in Seattle and my mom, they bought me and my girlfriend, the dog and all kind of stuff. I was, really? I'm like, why you go the easy way if you have the chance, you know? There's so many kids out there, they would love to go this way, but why we go always the easy way? It's brilliant, Jordan Morris, his <laughs> mum bought him a dog. That's why he stayed at Seattle. <laughs> By the way, I'm sure that, that conversation was in confidence, too. Well, that's, <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's a good thing. <laughs> Thank you, Jermaine. Appreciate that. I you told know, you that in confidence. Obviously, we, we, we're laughing about, about that particular. What, what, what do you make of this, Brian? I think what he's talking about is the fact that you have to have the desire to push yourself. And uh, in MLS, there isn't a culture like there is in Europe or South America. You have to, uh, you have, to have a drive that you want to get better and that you know every single day you step onto a soccer field, you can get better. And, and I think what he's trying to get across is the fact that in Europe, you have that. You're held more accountable more. Um, there is uh, someone always over your shoulder, whether it's in the first team that time or a young player that's coming up. And those situations, they prepare you because you know every single time you step over that line onto the training field, you better be sharp, you better be prepared, you better know, one, your job, and you also should be trying to improve every single day. You get a chance to play with players that have gone through that system. Mm. So you can, you can take from that. You can learn from other players. And I, would, would you advise someone to go to Europe? Right? You know what I've always said, and this is, this is the one part where I will say that if, if you are ready to go and you know the pitfalls of Europe, that means you're, you're going to a different culture. Yep. That means you, you're probably not going to be a, a guaranteed starter or even necessarily on the bench. Yep. And if you understand that if you don't even have the language, yep. those things, if you're not mentally prepared, can shut you down. I know this. Yeah, you, you, I was that. you experienced that. That, that, I, that was me in Wolfsburg. And my game faltered. But I did learn how to be a professional. I did learn how every single day I woke up, I better be ready to, to train, and I better be ready for everything that, that my coach is asking of me, or I won't get back into that first team. And if a, a player is prepared for that, and I think nowadays more and more the infrastructure they have in European clubs to make sure those players find an easier way yeah. to, to deal with it, then you must go. And I don't mean that to disparage MLS because MLS has gotten better and it's getting better. It's the culture. The players that come back from Europe can create that culture. So that's why people ask me, like, isn't it crazy that, that Bradley and Dempsey and, and Howard and everybody came back? And I'm like, no, that's not crazy. What their job now is to make sure that when they step into the training ground, when they walk through the locker room, when they step onto the training field, that you present a culture and accountability. And that helps MLS. Sure. Then you, you get your own culture. So um, I, I completely understand his, his, his rant.